Hello and welcome everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Farming Simulator 22. We are here at Southern Cross Station again. We are just coming out of our house. Lovely, lovely farmhouse. With the, uh... I don't know why the American flag is here in, um... In supposedly New South Wales, Australia, but whatever. Um, anyway, let's go ahead and continue where we left off. Um, let's see, let's go ahead and jump into our harvester here, because we were harvesting this field <coughs> last time we left off. So let's continue with that. We're going to continue harvesting this wheat. Yes, it is wheat. Um, we do have precision farming DLCs being used, because as you can see in the bottom left by the map, um, as we harvest, it is kind of giving us somewhat of our projected yield, or of the yield. So you see there that we are getting not good yield. We're getting a little above 50% yield. So the yield is not good. But it is a very large field. So we should be able to make some money off it. First, we're just going to store it, though. Um, because we have to wait and see if the price gets better. Because I don't think the price is good right now. But we will check in a minute. Let me go ahead and get to the end of here, this section of the field. And get a worker started on getting uh, harvesting and then we should go check I will also bring over the uh, the big rig over here with the big trailer the big grain trailer on it for us to uh, empty out the combine because it is getting full as you see we're at 60% with that let's go ahead and get started here get you started on this right there and away you go alright so let's go ahead down here and check. Um, prices. Wheat. Hold on. Wheat right now. Let's see. Wheat, 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 wheat. And you see we do have some canola. And let's go ahead and show the fluctuations. What month is it? It is currently, I think, August. Yes, we are in the current month. Right now, wheat is down. Um, it will go back up in September. But really, we need to wait till June is when it's at its highest. And then that's for canola. For wheat, it is July is the highest. Okay. And now we're on the downward trend. So it is up. We could sell it now, but it's on the downward trend. And what are we looking at right now? Oh, no, we're looking at down. It's all down. Although the canola still sells for quite a bit. We could drop off all the canola we have over here at Grain West Course. Seems to give us the best price at 1200 and five dollars per liter so we could do that let's go ahead and let's go ahead and start up our fun fun rostle mash here it looks like we still got places that we need to let's lift that oh no let's lift that back up sorry it was up already whoopsie we need to fix this while the workers going off and uh, harvesting we're going to go ahead and do some of this uh, cultivating here. Prepping this field for the next crop we are definitely going to put in. It seems like this thing does not want to uh, shift for some reason. I don't know why. It's still giving us this problem and it's driving me insane. Does it keep trying to go to high gear instead of staying in low? I guess. I don't know. I'm going to let a worker take off on that because I don't really care. Oh! What happened here? What happened here? Okay, where were you supposed to go? The store? Let's go up here. Where Where are you? He is... Where is that? Oh, there he is. So he's here. But he was supposed to go to the store. So let's go ahead and do this. Um, I'm going to have you go here. Go for it. Are you going to do the same thing again? Yes, you are. I swear. Well, let's go ahead and do this. We're going to have to drive him manually some of the way because he doesn't know what the hell he's doing. Let's look at the... Whoa, whoa, whoa. There we go. Okay. Yes, this road should take us right to the store. We're close by. <clears throat> we'll cross the train tracks here. 
and then we need to head to the left. Actually, hold on. Let's do this. Can I tag a place? Um, let's go back to the map. And then... Yes, I can. There. And there should be a beam of light. To my left. To my left. To my left. <laughs> uh, that's how much fun we have here, folks. Alright. This road should be good for this. There it is. So we did miss. Alright, let's put the map back on the small one. Here we go. And then make this turn. And here we are. Right here is the store. Now, did we purchase stuff or did we not purchase stuff? I don't remember what we needed to purchase. Anyway, he is here for now. Oh. No, no, because that's fine. The pallet fork is fine. Did I need to purchase fertilizer? I don't know. Anyway, let's go ahead and get this guy moving. Yes. We have to go over there and, and pick it up. So let's go. Turn the sucker around. There we go. As you see, I did have the AI worker do some of it. Or the, the AI worker, be the worker do some of this. Was not doing as good a job as I thought. So I do need to manually go around the headland myself. About two passes should be enough. And then the worker can take care of it. I probably should purchase the increased um, worker thingy. I can do that. I'm going to do that. But for right now... Wow, yeah, we have almost nowhere we can go. We're going to go ahead and open that. Leave you running. All right. Let's see what we can do here. Let's see if we can just turn you around. I think we can. I think we can. Yes, we can. Beautiful. Back you up a little bit. All right. Get out. Leave that running back into the truck. Pull you up underneath the nozzle here. Or the auger. Fill up the front section. All right now for the middle. Oh, no, no, middle. Thank you. All right, set that off. Let's go ahead and check. Yep, that's what I was afraid of. For some reason, the worker does not like this area. I mean, I get it. This is kind of crazy. I, I think we probably should sell this one because it's giving us problems. So I think I might go ahead and sell this tractor and get a different one. Nothing really against it. It's just that I, I'm trying to avoid all the problems we're having with it. it. It keeps like doesn't know what it wants to do shifting. And I'm like, yo, you, you can't do that. I got you. I got work you need to do. Let's do the work, you know? We got so much work to do on this farm to get everything ready. Okay, that area is complete. Let's go ahead and turn around. Try and get this other piece right here, and then we will go see about getting, fixing the edges there. Because I don't want to leave the edges out. Because <coughs> that's area where we could get yield. We could plant crops, we could get yield. So that's area I want to use. Yeah, this guy is struggling quite a bit with this. So much so. Yes, first gear, please. Okay, then second should be the next one. Yes, and stay in second. You don't need to go to third. Second is perfectly fine. Yes, yeah, so you didn't need to go to third. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to sell you and buy something better. Might have to take a little bit of a loan out. So this is what we're going to do. We are going to drop you off. Right. Detach you. We're going to move you out of this field and then hire a worker to drive you all the way down. I think that's what we're going to do and then sell you. Because it, it, we get more if we drive it to the store and sell it rather than if we um, just go into the menu and hit sell. Right. We get way more for it. I know I'm kind of wasting time here by doing this, but 
as soon as I can get him out of here and on his way, that's the important thing. If I remember right, we got to go down this way. Plus, it goes so slow, man. Look at how slow it's moving. Only 17 miles an hour. Yeah, it's a big boy, right? It's a really big boy. But for some reason, it just it does not like... It does not like to have... Um, for it to use that, that cultivator. It just doesn't like it for some reason. And it drives me nuts. I don't know why. Plus, since we have precision farming, what we can do is we can use get a tractor that has the precision farming thing attached to it already <clears throat> so that way we can use that to when we do our fertilizer spreading and then our also our seeding and our lime spreading like all of that we can use it for all of that which is not bad it's pretty good I think this is the right way yes it is I am correct Okay, let's get you through here. We're just going to cut through this field right here, and that should pop us out by the train tracks. And once we get down here, then we should be okay to hire a worker to drive this all the way through. Because if we do it right now, I don't know how it would be like, okay, we're going to go here. It'd probably be like, I don't know. And then maybe mess something up. So we're just going to go this way. We're going to cut through here. Oh. Oh. Okay. Boink. Oh. I, uh, I hit the fence. Is there any way we can get around here? Ah, driving through his fields. No! Good thing crop destruction is not on for this. <laughs> right? <laughs> Just driving through the cornfield. It's cool. And the corn just pops back up. That's fine. That's fine. Totally realistic, right? <laughs> it's okay. We, we do take some liberties with this. Uh, we, we do. Um, because it is fun. But And I'm all for trying to do the realism. But, you know, look. We're just rolling over corn. <laughs> uh, that's too funny. That's okay. We will hit the road here soon. So we will be okay. Once we hit the road, I'll go ahead and hire a driver to drive this down, and then we can go ahead and continue on with what we are doing. Here's the road right here. No, it's a stream. Oh, whoopsie. Oh, well. In we go. Ha! <laughs> That's funny. And we're swimming. I didn't know that. My bad. Okay. Um, so what we are going to do, we're going to go to... Where are you? This, and we're going to reset it. And yes. Okay. It's at the shop. So we're going to go ahead and put this pipe down. And then here we go. All right, worker. Do your magic. We're going to start getting this harvested. Let's go over here. Right. There we go. Look at that. Nice, nice clean lines. That's kind of what I want to do is with this. Is this? We'll get this taken care of, and then we can move on. Oop, that's good. We're gonna get super close to the fence here. Hold on, hold on. There we go. Nice. All right, let's just start picking this up here. get this headland done and then we'll have more room to maneuver because we are so close to the fence so close and then you have the little the river running through here through our property we try not to uh hit anything with it but you know it it does happen keep harvesting all this good wheat this should bring us a good fair bit of money um i am going to sell i'm going to store the wheat and then turn around and sell the uh the canola because canola seems to be the cash crop right now so that's what we're going to do. Maybe barley is what we'll plant in the other field. I don't know. We'll see what uh, we can plant right now. Because Seasons is turned on. Therefore, we have to. We can only plant certain crops at certain times. At some point, I would probably like to do cotton. Just because I, I've never really harvested cotton before. Except for on a contract. So I think cotton would be very good to do. I think it would be something nice to do on stream. Or video. 
I think it'd be enjoyable. We get to see the big, huge cotton harvesters and go, oh, okay, so that's how those things work. Because they are kind of neat. Here we go. All the way back here, and this is what I'm talking about. Nice, good area. And that is done. Go ahead and lift the header. Position ourselves for a worker to take charge. Almost hit a tree. But we did. That's what matters. All right, set the worker off on that. We're going to go ahead and shut that off. There we are. Here he is. Okay. All right, let's go ahead and drive you right up here. All right, we're going to go here. Boop. Um, let's go ahead and repair it, right? That's a lot to repaint. All right, let's repaint it. Um, and then we are going to sell it back. We should get 191000 for it. Nice. It has been sold. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to check and see how much that cultivator was needed for that cultivator. No, 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 no. No. Um, 375 horsepower. Okay. That's fine. What about our cedar? 180 horsepower. Okay, the cedar's not bad. Oh, that's why I need seeds. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go in here to tractors. We want a large tractor. We need 375 horsepower, right? The fence, fine. Right, they can do it. Not too big on John Deere because of where we are. Um, the JCB would not be able to pull it. Uh, let's see. This is actually kind of cool. The Terra Track would be kind of cool. Um, we do not have that kind of money, though, so we need to go a little bit cheaper. Honestly, the only thing we could buy is the Fent. Ooh. Well, let's see what we have down at this end, too, right? No, that's still too much. The Big Bud. What do you have? 450. And you're under our price range, and you could possibly pull that. Let's see if you can. I think you could. I think you could pull that. That's not bad, honestly. But I'm thinking more of something else. Okay, let's go back. Let's go to medium tractors because I know there's a medium tractor we can get that's got that kind of high. It's on this end, right? The the Dirtsfafner. No, no, not the Kubotas. Um, what is that? 287 for that. That's only 300. No, 313. No, we can't. Okay, so we do need a large tractor. Okay. Well, let's do this. I hate to do it, but we kind of have to. Let's go ahead and borrow. We have no loans, so let's go ahead and borrow some. Because we need to be able to afford all our maintenance costs. So we're going to borrow $70,000 just because. Right? And then we will get back in here. Let's get something we know can keep up with what we're going to do. See, that's 351 starting. And that's fine. This is 355 starting. So this should be able to do all of our needs right here. <clears throat> See, there is the Rostel Mash, right? And it was fine, but it just it did not do what we needed it to do. Look at all these big bad boys. Jeez Louise. They're so huge. They're huge. 352. Wow. Okay, so let's go down here. I'm okay with this one. Let's see. I'm fine with that license plate, right? Big boy. Um, yes, we're going to add the uh, the precision farming thing, right? Ooh, wide tires. Wide tires, please, because we're going to pull something big. All right, and we start with 355 horsepower. That should be good enough. We're going to go ahead and buy that bad boy. No, it's 370 and we have 350. We can't. Crapola. All right, let's go back down then. What can we get? Um, let's see here. What do you start with? 325. There we go. 355. You're at 294. That's why that's so expensive is because of that. Um, do, do, do. Wide tires and wheel weights should be fine. That'll bring us up to 312, but we'll still have some left over. Because that way we can definitely pull what we need to pull with this. Because the wide tires and the wheel weights will work. 
Okay, I'm okay with that. Let's go ahead and buy this bad boy. Yay! Alright, we bought a new vehicle. Where are you? There you are. Hi, hello. Hello. We probably should get a wait for you as well, shouldn't we? Um, let's see. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Where are you? There you are. Ha! Alright. Nope. All the way over. Let's see. There we go. 1,800 weight. Or, yes, that should be it. A weight in the front. Yes. Wow, that's a lot. Let's do... Hmm. I think... Yeah, let's do that. Let's do the 2200. Rather be safe than sorry, right? So let's go ahead and snag this weight. I'm going to pick it up. Alright, we have the weight. Alright. Now that we have that, we're going to take our happy butts over here. Back this up slightly. There we go. Okay. And then you, sir. We're going to have you create a job. You're going to go to... We're going to put this right here. There. Go for it. Oh, he is full again. Okay. Let's go ahead and back you up. Alrighty. Where are you? There you are. Let's go ahead and bring you around. Good sir. Gonna bring this around. Pick up more of this stuff. Now that we have all the, the stuff going and we've got the new tractor going back to the, the farm, that is fine. We can use that to, to cultivate that field and then we're going to plant. So what's going to happen is I'm going to continue on with the harvesting. And we're going to finish harvesting this field. Get it nice and harvested. So that way we have some wheat we can make some money off of or use for feed. Uh, depending on if we're going to do any, any animals. I think we are. I think we're probably going to do some chickens. Because they can make some okay money with the eggs. We can sell them to a production facility, bakery or something like that. And we could possibly make some good money off that. So I am all for that. Because we do have a $70,000 loan we have to pay off now. Because of the uh, having to buy that new truck. Alright, middle is full. Fill this up all the way. All right, well, I will continue on with the harvesting and the, the carting, and uh, I think we're going to jump cut this, maybe uh, maybe time lapse it. We'll see if I can figure that out <laughs> on the editing, uh, but yes, we will see you all very soon.
and we're back. Welcome back, everybody. As you see, I've uh, we've got a lot more of the field done. <coughs> the field is done. Um, we are bringing seed back, right? I hired a driver to bring some seed back. Load, bought some, loaded some up on the trailer here. Got the seed coming back, so we can seed the other field. We have one hopper full, two more to go over here in this one. Our truck, I parked the Fiat back, the old Fiat tractor back where it's supposed to be, uh, underneath some shade. Got the class tractor right here. Let's see. Got a worker still going on this field. It is so huge, it's taking so long. Where are you with the seed? Come on, dude. He is trucking along trying to bring the seed back. It's gonna take him a minute. For some reason, the, the AI drivers, as you see, he's not doing a whole lot. He keeps going around and around and around and around and around. So we're just going to leave him to it. Um, we're going to go ahead and keep up with the harvesting here. We're going to keep harvesting this field, get the wheat in, hopefully before we go to sleep tonight. Because if we don't, I don't know if it's going to be here tomorrow. Because I don't remember how many days I put in a month. I think just one day a month which is not good. I probably should ex open that to two just because. Actually, I think I did. I think I changed that to two just for seasons. Hold on, let's take a look see, right? Let's see, five times speed. Yes, two days per month and it'll change the next season. So when we get out of this, uh, looks like summer. Dude, really, you're driving all over the wheat crop. You're driving all over the wheat crop. What are, what are you doing? This is why I don't like the AI drivers that much. Like the the workers, they uh, sometimes I wonder about them. Hey, he's right here. So instead of you wilding about, and uh, let's just go. We're gonna take charge. We're gonna bring him in. Here we are, right here. Let's go ahead and pull up to the cedar, and we're gonna go ahead and start filling the cedar with some seed because we need to. It is over here on the other side of the silo. Here is our cedar. We're going to pull you up alongside. Right. Hop in the class. Put some lights on so we can see. Let's see. We're going to go ahead and open the cover. Oh, wait. No, I can't open the cover. We've got to unfold it first. Ooh. So we're going to go ahead and unfold it. There we go. All nice and unfolded. Go ahead and pull up here. Open this cover. All right. And we're going to go ahead and fill it with some seed. Look at all that seed going. Keep going. Keep going. Let's refill it. Let's refill it. Let's fill it as much as we possibly can. Take all of the seed. One more. One more. So I was not that bad for buying four things of seed. That gave us 4,200 liters of seed. That is not bad. So what we're going to do here, we're going to refold you. We're going to come over here. That is not bad. We're going to go buy some more seed. So we're going to turn you around. Head you back out to the outside the gate of the farm. And we're going to send you back. Not quite yet. We'll wait till tomorrow. Tomorrow we'll send him back down. Because it is getting late today. So we'll go ahead and stop you right there. Alright. Go ahead and open up. Bring up the truck here. Let's see where are we going. Over here, over here, over here. Yes, sir. Let's go ahead and whip you around. And we're going to start pull you up alongside the, the combine here and empty the grain tank. Yes, sir. There we go. Here we are. Hold on. There we go. Go ahead and fill this up some more. Trying to get the trying to get this harvest in. We might have to wait till tomorrow. But I really don't want to wait till tomorrow. 
this episode is running kind of long so i want to go ahead and finish up this episode and then we will continue on in the next but not until after we finish filling up emptying out the combine into the trailer oh okay all right if you want to do it that way we go ahead and move out of the way here so we're not in the combine's way because that is bad oh i turned on too many lights <laughs> okay where are you combine there you are jumping you there we go not too much more left that should be okay um we are going to go ahead and call it here for today ladies and gentlemen thank you so much for joining me we will continue with the harvest of this field next episode um and then we're going to start planting the other field that we have finished cult we finished cultivating it so we're going to go ahead and plant don't know what we're going to plant yet we'll figure it out next episode thank you so much for joining me i do appreciate you hey, if you like what you see like share subscribe and follow until next time y'all take care bye for now